Hello everyone, today I'm going to be doing my Doctor Who tag, thanks to Danny Brown for tagging me. So, yeah, let's get on. My favourite Doctor is easily John Pertwee. He is just amazing as to Doctor. You know, his style, his stories are classics. You know, the Master, the Brigadier, the Sea Devils, you know. He had such an amazing run and... Honourable mention to the Tenth Doctor, you know, he's amazing, and Peter Capaldi, the Twelfth Doctor, amazing as well. Easily Sarah Jane Smith, just easily, I don't care. Sarah Jane is amazing as a companion, I know I'm saying amazing all the time, but yeah, she's great, you know, she's got chemistry with the Doctor, you know, with John Purby and Tom Baker, you know, her stories are cool and also honorable mention to donna noble she's funny classic and you know just amazing again so what i can say now i became a doctor who fan in 2005 when i first watched rose with the ninth doctor straight after that um, my dad introduced me to the classics where he showed me john pertwee the three doctors and I, that's when i fell in love with doctor who it was just so good and it scared me so it really kept you know an essence in me to keep watching and it still scares me sometimes now yeah I do sound like a pussy but oh well from the new series of Doctor Who when it was revamped it's a Sontaran stratagem in the poison sky it was just amazing <laughs> um from the classics it's easily the three doctors because that's the first I watched and yeah, they're my favourite episodes. From classic Doctor Who's Twin Dilemma, that is just... I couldn't even finish it, it made me sick. But, you know, I had to finish it when I did a marathon. But the, from New Who, it's either Love and Monsters, hated that, like everyone else. And the new In the Forest of the Night, which... Let's just say is... Uh, you know, his plot-wise was good, but it was just executed poorly. My favourite monster or alien is either the Cybermen. I, I just fell in love with them as soon as I saw them. The Silence, they're just mysterious and, you know, they're so creepy and oh, I just love them. And the Ice Warriors, their stories are perfect. None of them can be, you know, made better. You know, Cold War... Everyone seems to, not everyone, but everyone seems to have a little issue with it, but it is, to me, one of the best of Series 7. I don't like the Sontarans. I, I know my favourite episode from New Who is the Sontaran Stratum and the Poison Sky, but they just seem to have gone downhill since then. You know, the classics, they're all right, they're mediocre at best, but New Who... Sontara Strax and Poison Sky, perfect. And then after that, where did the Sontarans go? All we've got now is Strax. They can become perfect if they do another story where Strax is in it and has to decide whether to go with his, you know, his race or the Doctor. That would be amazing. Also, I don't like the Silurians. You know, Doctor Who and the Silurians was perfect in every way, even though it's seven episodes long. But New Who has portrayed them as these things who don't know if they're good or bad. I know that's what they were, but I don't like it. So yeah, these next two are suggested from my sister, because she's weird. <laughs> so she just thought, and these actually sound pretty cool, so I'm going to decide to add them anyway. Favourite master, definitely Roger Delgado. You know, amazing, again, from John Pertwee's era. You know, all his stories are sublime. Every single one everyone and I, Michelle Gomez as Missy is just perfect you know she really kept the character living of the master you know with John Sim it was a bit uh, you know he's not really that good but with Missy she felt like the master she actually felt insane which I just loved about the new series is that Missy and I can't wait to see her again to see where her character is going to go from New Who Series 4 is the best series ever. It's the one I have watched the most. I love every single episode in there. None of them are bad. They are so good. 
from classic, it's either seven or eight from John Perry, as they're great stories, great arcs, great characters, great monsters, perfect. So yeah, there's my Doctor Who tag. Thank you for listening. I hope you enjoyed. I'm not going to tag anyone because, I don't know, if you're listening to this, please do it. If you've done it already, then, alright, just tag someone you know. I don't know anyone from the top of my head. I forgot to write it down. So yeah, just anyone who's listening to this, please do it if you're confident enough. If you can't, just comment below your answers. I don't care how you do it. So yeah, thanks Denny Brown for, Denny, Danny Brown for tagging me. There you go, it took me ages, but it's done. Thank you and goodbye.